storm. That's the end. Hi, I'm Rocky, here to show you the game. Ladies and gentlemen, the great pronoun race is about to begin. Please select your team of... Rufus Xavier Sarsaparilla And I could say that Rufus found a kangaroo That followed Rufus home and now that kangaroo belongs To Rufus Xavier Sarsaparilla Whew, I could say that but I don't have to Cause I got pronouns I can say He found a kangaroo that followed him home And now it is his You see huh? He him and his our pronouns Replacing the noun Rufus Xavier Sarsaparilla A very proper noun and it is a pronoun, replacing the noun, kangaroo. How come? Now Rufus has a sister named Rafaela Gabriela Sasparella. If she found a kangaroo, I'd say to you, she found a kangaroo that followed her home, and now it is hers. But I can't say that, because she found an odd bar that fell in love with her, and they're so happy. And my name's Albert Andrea Samadilla, no relation to the sarsaparillas. Because of pronouns, I can say, I wish she would find a rhinoceros for me, and we'd be happy. You see, a pronoun was made to take the place of a noun. Cause saying all those nouns over and over can really wear you down. Now I can tell you Raffaella, Gabriella, and Rufus Xavier Sarsaparilla and Albert Andrea Samadilla found an aardvark, a kangaroo, and a rhinoceros. And now that aardvark and that kangaroo and that rhinoceros belong respectively to Raffaella, Gabriella, Sarsaparilla, and Rufus Xavier Sarsaparilla and Albert Andrea Samadilla. Because of pronouns I can say in this way, we found them and they found us and now they are ours and we're so happy. Thank you, pronoun. You see, a pronoun was made to take the place of a noun. Cause saying all those nouns over and over can really wear you down. Sometimes when we take them all on the bus, people really raise a fuss. They start shouting out a lot of pronouns at us like, who brought that rhinoceros on this bus and what made that horrible noise and which one of them getting off first? Who, what, and which has special pronouns that can ask a question in a sense where you do not know the name of the noun. But I know I have mine and she has hers and he has his, do you have yours? They love us and we love them. What's ours is theirs, that's how it is with friends. And pronouns, you are really friends, yeah. Cause saying all those nouns over and over can really wear you down. Select a team. Rufus, Xavier, Sasparilla. Thanks for picking me.
Since you're adding up coins and keeping the score, I'll help you out by giving you four. Ladies and gentlemen. Hey. Click. Woo. You sure gotta climb a lot of steps to get to this Capitol building here in Washington. Well, I wonder who that sad little scrap of paper is. I'm just a bill, yes, I'm only a bill, and I'm sitting here on Capitol Hill. Well, it's a long, long journey to the Capitol City. It's a long, long wait while I'm sitting in committee, but I know I'll be a law someday, at least I hope and pray that I will, but today I am still just a bill. Gee, Bill, you certainly have a lot of patience and courage. Well, I got this far. When I started, I wasn't even a bill. I was just an idea. Some folks back home decided they wanted a law passed, so they called their local congressman, and he said, you're right, there ought to be a law. Then he sat down and wrote me out and introduced me to Congress, and I became a bill. And I'll remain a bill until they decide to make me a law. I'm just a bill. Yes, I'm only a bill. And I got as far as Capitol Hill. Well, now I'm stuck in committee and I'll sit here and wait while a few key congressmen discuss and debate whether they should let me be a law. I hope and pray that they will, but today I am still just a bill. Listen to those congressmen arguing. Is all that discussion and debate about you? Yeah, I'm one of the lucky ones. Most bills never even get this far. I hope they decide to report on me favorably, otherwise I may die. Die? Yeah, die in committee. Oh, but it looks like I'm going to live. Now I go to the House of Representatives and they vote on me. If they vote yes, what happens? Then I go to the Senate and the whole thing starts all over again. Oh, no. Oh, yes. I'm just a bill, yes, I'm only a bill, and if they vote for me on Capitol Hill, well, then I'm off to the White House where I'll wait in a line with a lot of other bills for the president to sign, and if he signs me, then I'll be a law, I hope and pray that he will, but today I am still just a bill. You mean even if the whole Congress says you should be a law, the president can still say no? Yes, that's called a veto. If the president vetoes me, I have to go back to Congress and they vote on me again, and by that time you're so By old, that time, you? it's very unlikely that you become a law. It's not easy to become a law, is it? No, but how I hope and pray that I will, but today I am still just a bill. He signed your bill, now you're a law. Oh, yes! The busy peas sure love building things. You can help them by locating the prepositions. Each time you find a preposition, you'll get a piece of the project that the peas are building. When you get all the pieces, click on one and drag it into the right place. You can use the blueprint to figure out where the pieces belong. If you need help, click on the question mark. Uh. Uh. 